Okay, quick more a couple of things. One, um, a lot, I've heard quite a few arguments against Al Gore's an inconvenient truth, not because of accuracy uh, pertaining to what he said, but um, also because of the fact that there was things like, oh, he drives a Hummer and that sort of thing. Those are what are called ad hominem attacks. Those attack his character, and comp uh, which may or may not be true, and are completely irrelevant from the actual scientific data pertaining to climate change and whether or not we are influencing an already existing natural process. So those sort of things are not appropriate. Uh, you know, they don't help the argument or proper discussion one way or the other. Um, again, other arguments uh, pertaining to lack of peer-reviewed literature. Um, Al Gore's movie, An Inconvenient Truth, and his book cover this in greater detail. And again, uh, references uh, in both the Scientific American article and the Skeptical Inquirer articles I referred to. Um, go check the sources for your own verification. Now, the next video, we'll start getting in on the actual science behind um, global warming and what physical processes actually contribute to it.